Today marks seven years since Eric Garner died after being restrained by police on Staten Island. Garner's family went back to the spot where it happened to celebrate his life and continue to push for justice. CBS 2's Nick Calloway reports. Seven years ago today, my son was murdered. Emotions come flooding back as Eric Garner's mother, Gwen Carr, joined dozens of others on Bay Street to remember a life cut short. Garner died on July 17, 2014, when Officer Daniel Pantaleo used an unauthorized chokehold on him. Pantaleo was later fired by the NYPD. I'm reliving that, um, but I'm coming to grips with it by fighting for him. That continued fight against police brutality was magnified last year after the murder of George Floyd set off a national movement for racial equality and justice and police reform. But Garner's family says they want all the officers involved to face justice. We're still talking about it. We're still going to court about it. And we're still trying to get the officers to stand accountable, the ones who was responsible for my son's death that day. Jewel Miller brought her and Eric Garner's young daughter, Legacy. Miller said even after all these years, all she's seen is lip service. It's the same as seven years ago. No justice has been served um, at all. Um, we've got a lot of streets named after us to kind of, you know, be quiet, but no justice has been served at all. The anniversary comes the same week an appeals court ruled that a judicial inquiry is warranted into the investigation of Garner's death. We want to see every knee email. We want to see every phone log. Reverend Al Sharpton held an anniversary service to honor Garner's life. He said the judicial inquiry could provide some much needed transparency into the investigation. Part of the victory will be why did it take so long uh -huh. to see this policeman terminated when it should have been immediate? And what was the inside language memos going back and forth? We can now get that. Advocates say they'll be back here on Bay Street every year until there's justice for Eric Garner and all the others who died unarmed at the hands of the police. In the Tompkinsville section of Staten Island, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News.